guys, today is Sunday, May the 4th, so, let's see what I did today. Okay, 161.4. Hey guys, so today's May 4th, it's already late at night, um, not very productive today, um, this morning. I had my leftover um, Indian food and I just ate like an hour ago. Um, had to do last minute shopping for my trip and just super exhausted from what happened to me on Friday and yesterday I worked a lot, got home at night and um, I just made sure I slept today and I woke up really late. Um, and back to work tomorrow, and I'm leaving for Kelly this Saturday, and happy, but at the same time stressed about what happened to me. So, um, yeah. Just really tired, exhausted, emotional, physically, just everything. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna do my cleanse tomorrow. I actually have dinner with a friend on Wednesday, so I will be eating, of course, but besides that, I'm just gonna do my lemonade drink, and, um, yeah, alright, bye guys. It's Monday, 7 de Mayo, May 5th, and about to get on scale, I feel bloated, haven't gone yet after my water flush, shockingly, alright, probably gained because I ate yesterday. Happy Cinco de Mayo! If I was in Cali, I would have been partying up with my homies, but no one seems to care around here. It's not big in the lovely racist world of Ohio. But anyway, um, I am extremely drained and tired, not feeling too well, just because of what happened to me on Friday, and I am stressed at work dealing with special people. I mean, can you tell, like, I look tired. Anyway, I got home, I took a nap, woke up, started to slowly pack. Yeah, I haven't packed. Usually, I'm, like, prepared weeks ahead. This time, I have, like, what, four days left. And I started with stuff in a luggage. Um, There's bits and pieces of stuff in the room that I have to put in later, like, the day before I leave. And I will attempt to clean my room before I leave to make it perfect, nice, and beautiful. So, um, I was just moody and overwhelmed and stressed because short and staff and people just being special. And I was really overwhelmed and everything was just given to me just because I was overwhelmed and new shit. But it's of my work life. Um, I didn't feel good. I took out of practice this morning. I think it's just because... I haven't been able to sleep since what happened to me. Stressed out. Stressed out. I kind of found out some good news, but then I don't know yet. But, um... So, I worked all day in a chair. Probably went to the bathroom twice. Constantly on the phone. Lots of paperwork and patient stuff. I didn't realize that all of a sudden it was 4 o'clock. Like I was working my ass off. All day. Didn't have lunch or anything. Not like I was going to eat lunch. But I didn't even drink my magic cleanse. I drank like half of it in my bottle. Usually I was able to drink like four or five. And I was not in the mood to drink or eat or anything. But this morning I gained three pounds. So I've been up three pounds. Off three pounds. Up, down. And then I got home. I felt really dizzy. And just tired. It's drained. And the weather is extremely cold again. It's May. And I'm freaking in a hoodie. Like... This is weird, but that's Ohio for you. So, um, I will attempt to drink my lemonade all day tomorrow and eat something too because just how I've been feeling, so not so much of a cleanse. I'm still shitting shit, which is yay for me because even I'm stressed, like super stressed like this, I have trouble pooing, so that's a plus for me. And I'm still gonna drink my laxative tea just in case. But, um, can you tell I'm tired? <sighs> yeah. 
I come back, I might attempt to look for another job. I don't know. We'll see. It's hard. It is hard to find good people to be around with. And the nice people aren't the nicest people. It's like, why am I being all those crazy ass, two faced people? I'm just. I swear to God, I had issues with people back home, but nothing compared to this. Like, I had great group of friends that understood me and we came from all different walks of life how is that possible that we all get along back home and no one's fucking bipolar i know because it's fucking sunny at home and over here one day it's stormy another day it's sunny then it's raining then it's snowing blah 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 oh and anyone out there owns a macbook macbook air Row or with Retina, I want to get an Apple laptop. I've been wanting for years. Just been hesitating because it's so expensive, but I love Apple products and it has iMovie and I can edit stuff. I'm starting to like making videos and, um, Also, the fact that it took me forever, I actually got paid. Not a lot, but, well, I was surprised. But, I've been vlogging since 2009, so, I can't believe it, so. But anyway, besides the money, which I thought I wouldn't get any more money, I don't know, it's weird, I don't understand. I was really shocked when it happened. Um... Making videos make me feel better, makes me vent. It's like my side hobby. I was so into it before and I stopped just because of stuff going on. In the past few weeks or so, I've been vlogging a lot because of what I've been doing. And I'm excited to go back to Cali because I, I will be vlogging a lot. And if you guys watch my past videos, you'll see some of my friends. And these are the same people that I will be vlogging with. So, I will be doing a lot of that. But yeah, I don't know which one to get because there's so like pros and cons with the Apple laptop so far that I have read about because I'm not like computer tech savvy or whatever. The MacBook Air is light, um, lasts long but n not much storage and it doesn't come with an SD slot but just two USB slots and I mean it has iMovie but the storage part is not much the next one the MacBook Pro um, more storage battery last lesser than the MacBook Air but it has USB slots and also the SD card slot which I love so I wouldn't have to buy an extra one to connect. And just more storage. And they say if you want to edit videos and stuff, it's a plus. And then there's the MacBook Retina, which is more and more expensive, but better image quality. I don't know. I'm in, I'm in between a MacBook Air and a MacBook Pro. What you guys recommend? I just want to fucking edit videos. I mean, I like the MacBook Air, but in the thought of, like, not much storage. So, I don't know. I'm just confused. Yeah. So, um, and it's like a hundred turn difference. So, that is all. I will continue to vlog. And uh, thank you to all my new subscribers. So, um, if I don't get to, like, 149, which I doubt by Saturday, then blah. Because I'm going to eat. And come back, just keep working if I do end up working out again. So, bye guys.